this one isn't so rough. The summer rough, and even they, they brush it, see. clean it, and get at least fine metal particles on, they just can't get them off. Yeah, yeah. So the only way to do it is pressure wash it. Uh -huh. This came out immaculate. Uh -huh. Same thing with this one. Well, I have another one that's really porous, and I can never get it perfectly clean, you know, yeah. really good. So it gets the inside and everything? Inside this is how I put it in the washer, just like this. Well, I mean, does it get it, does it get in here? And, yeah. and crannies everywhere. Got, this is how I went into the washer, uh -huh. picked it up and set on the skid yesterday, and that's how it came out. And it was really dark brown, real dark brown from the oil sort of baked on it, dirty oil. I'm running for like five years up in a wind tower up in the Mojave Desert. Uh-huh. Oh my gosh, it came out amazing. And how long, how would you guys clean that before? He, he picked this up with a hook of rope around here and lean it up and set it in the parts washer. He'd be take a brush by hand, just like this, over the whole thing. It'd take him a couple of hours to do. Oh man! Just one thing would take him a couple hours, and then I've got well, I have a, you know four gears he did. Well, that skid over there, we look at that. That takes him a few hours to do it. it all this stuff came in one wash. That's awesome. Save a lot of time. And even this one, went all the way down inside, it was really dirty down the bottom. But it, it, it did the whole thing, you know? Yeah. That's impressive. What saves me a lot of time is like these cases. I'd take them a couple days to get a PO. Then we'd take a, a day or two to get over to steam clean. Another day or two to get it back. You're talking five, six days sometimes. Well, I can put that in there in 15 minutes, <laughs> turn it right around and start putting it back together. Yeah, that'll make the customer happy. Oh my God. Save them five, six days.